I'm done this in a minute. This is nerve wracking. What's up, beautiful humans? It's your girl, Amber. And today, we are gonna catch up with my life for a second. Now, I know a lot of y'all are here right now because of the title, because y'all want to be in my business and talk about my love life, my dating life, etc. And we're going to get into that. But before I get into that, I'm going to tell y'all about everything that's been going on with me this year and why I needed to take a little break and slow down and what's going on. And before we get into that, let me update y'all real quick, because I don't know if y'all have seen a couple of my videos this year, but I have been dropping little like political facts and environmental facts and things that's just going on with our society society or our politics just to keep y'all aware of like what's happening and things that we should be paying attention to now I'm happy to update y'all and say that just recently the monumental infrastructure deal was finally passed by Congress and what this means is help is on the way from people having access to high internet speeds to the advancement of environmental justice to investing in communities that are too often left behind so huge changes are coming y'all now let's get back to talking about my life now listen your girl has has been so busy this year. And literally everything that I asked for last year came to fruition. Like I manifested everything I wanted plus, plus, plus more. I mean, let me tell you, the opportunities and the amazing things that happened were in abundance, you feel me? So much so that your girl got overwhelmed like crazy. I mean, to be real with y'all, from mid-May all the way to the end of October was so back to back to back to back busy for me. Your girl damn near blacked out. I mean, for real, I've never been so busy but blessed but overwhelmed at the same time you feel me I mean I just couldn't say no to all these opportunities that were coming up because the year before I didn't have that you feel me and I know that some of y'all can probably understand or just relate to this but it got to a point where I had to completely stop and slow down and just work on self right I mean but let's be real the blessings were amazing from doing panels to hosting events hosting different prides to filming shows filming my own content and also content with my my group case which by the way we started our own YouTube channel and TikTok and Instagram look for all the links in the comments below to traveling doing huge brand deals and also doing a lot of content for other companies or brands I mean it was absolutely amazing and I am so blessed I'm not trying to take away from that at all but what I did tell y'all about a year and a half ago is that I started to develop anxiety and nowadays those lists of things to do that used to motivate me now overwhelm me a little bit so then I didn't even realize what was going on with me until I completely just you feel me and I had to just like say no and cut off everything and let me tell you when I finally did that and slowed down and literally started to only prioritize the things that I needed to do to get by it felt amazing I started to take the time to dive into myself like all the things to care for myself and also just to pay attention to what I was going through like my emotions being all over the place I mean it's the time of the year holiday season a lot of stuff comes up for people so instead of like me just ignoring it I was really just like let me breathe breathe let me just like check in with self and see what's going on and really like heal myself through those things and it was amazing and I want to say that like I have gone through a lot when it comes to my love life in the last couple years right it's been some ups and downs some hardships I've told you all about some really weird dating experiences I also have a dating show coming out but I can't say anything else other than that and that's just a whole nother thing right but what I want to say is like when I really started to like slow down and just focus on self and being the best version of myself and really just like refilling my cup somebody came into my life so unexpectedly that just literally makes me feel completely fulfilled I mean my soul is the happiest it's ever been this is the most effortless situation that I've ever been in and it's just like so fulfilling to the point where I can't even explain it to y'all right and listen I know y'all are gonna be so mad at me because I have been nothing but an open book all these years and shared every part of my life but this part I can't kind of want to just keep for a while and I'm not gonna say forever but just for a little while so let me just nurture it you know what I'm saying let me go through it for a little bit and then we'll see what's up you feel me but I just wanted to tell y'all you know what I'm saying your girl was out here in these streets and the streets weren't for me and then all of a sudden I get 
hit with something that I never expected, but it was the best unexpected thing I've ever had. So I just wanted to share that with y'all because your girl's happy, happy, you feel me? And I hope y'all are happy for me. And I'm gonna talk about some stuff in a New Year's resolution video, but I just wanna say that like this year was full of ups and downs, like all kinds of opportunities, but at the same time, like I lost some people um, in real life and then also I just lost some friends. But when that happens, you just gain new ones, people that are supposed to be in your life that are actually filling your cup and not just draining your energy, that part right there, right? So as a reminder, when you slow down a little bit and take care of yourself, dive in and do some inner work, great things start happening. And that's what happened with me. Anyways, I would love to know what's going on with y'all and how you feel about all this. Please leave it in the comments below. And if there's any topics or videos that you want me to cover in the future, please put them in the comments and I'll see y'all soon with more videos. I love y'all so much. Stay amazing, stay proud, and stay woke. Peace.